Are you recording? All right. Brussels sprouts. <laughs> it's not that difficult. <laughs> it's These are uh, Tony's famous lemon Brussels sprouts. Correct. We begged for them in the house. We do. They literally take five minutes once you um, cut the Brussels Prepare sprouts. So. so these have been already cut. By John. And by John. And the cameraman. We've cut some garlic here. Again, I'm just going to smash a garlic and I'm just going to cut it in half just because I want the flavor to just get to more places. And then with these, we've washed them, pre-washed them, and you just cut off the end and then just cut them in the middle. Again, end, middle, end, middle, end, middle, and middle. And that's it. And then, so we'll take these guys here. And don't like, don't be afraid of the leaves, right? Because they actually not brown be up and they have make a beautiful bedding for the big pieces of Brussels sprouts. So then, so I'll take this out of the way for our soup. What we're gonna do is we're just gonna literally pour a lot of olive oil. I mean, I Mom. drenched them. We're not afraid of oil. And Maybe then me either. I'm gonna take the garlic. I'm gonna throw it in. Then we're gonna take the lemons. I like to just sieve it through my fingers. This way I catch the pits. Um, actually, this is a trick that Stephanie taught me, believe it or not, in 1998. And it works great. Yeah, just let the seeds fall in the crevice of your hand and then that's your strainer. Great. And hold on, we'll put in another lemon. And then I usually take these beautiful rinds and I don't throw them away. I put them immediately in a glass and then I throw water on them. These are organic. And then I have wonderful one concentrated more. lemon water. And so I'll soak them like that. Now no we're going to put in some pepper. Do you need some salt? I have it. Here. I like to go heavy with the salt and pepper. Oh yeah. On this dish. No, no fear. And then you gotta get your hands dirty. You gotta get your hands dirty. So we're gonna mix it all up. And one got away. Now we're gonna put them in our Thank I you. like to use this baking dish, these because they just seem to um, cook drier yeah. and darken faster. They don't get soggy as much. I'll put that in there. And guys, that's, I mean, that's how it. fast that's it. you can make Brussels sprouts with lemon. And then we're just gonna throw them in the oven, which has been preheating. We're at, we're at 375. We're at 375. And these actually might take a while. So I usually let them cook for at least 45 minutes to an hour. No. And every... Is it an hour? Yeah, and every once in a while, we I'll just turn them, turn ten, them ten to make sure that they get roasted all around and that they get nice and black. So we'll be back. Great. Oh my God, we... All right, guys, we're gonna, we've been cooking for about 15 minutes. Oh my God, this looks good. See how lovely, see how the, the leaves are starting to curl up a little bit on the outside? but then you're seeing a little bit darker color green on the inside. That means that you're doing really good with the cooking temperature. I'm gonna lower it to 350 because I don't wanna have them dry out too much, but this is great. Loving everything about this. Great, we'll be back in about 15 minutes. Perfect. All right guys, Brussels sprouts are done. They were actually ended up being about 40 minutes in the oven. We kept checking them regularly. And they're looking pretty gorgeous. Come on over. So some are kind of nice and dried leaves, but then on the inside they're nice and tender. So you get really, really good flavor throughout. We love when the leaves get brown like that. Gorgeous pieces of garlic for those who love to pop some garlic in their mouth. And are one of our favorite vegetables, Brussels sprouts. We're dedicating this dish to Dahlia from Belgium. And there you go. Beautiful. Great, thanks. Tom! Here are your Brussels sprouts, Dave. 
him. Ta-da! These are literally three minute Brussels sprouts. It took three minutes to prep after the cutting. That's it. And then went in the oven. Let's try. Try that. I like these. The little guys are crunchy. Mm. Uh-oh. Oh. Look at the leaves. Look at the leaves. That's why you need to keep the leaves in there. Oh, cameraman in action! Camera person is, camera woman is, uh... Heidi, <laughs> what do you think, Al? Delicious. Mm. Mm.